my name is Atunde. Um, all right, today is um, I think today is January fifth, right? If I'm correct, uh, January fifth. Uh, so things that couple of things that I picked up that I think is going to be useful. I I started looking into Linux Academy, and um, I mean looking at all the um, options, complete options by GCP. And some of the advantages, and I, um, I, I picked up a couple of stuff. For example, uh, the fact that GCP allows you to create custom image, uh, images like AWS, low preemptible uh, VM, uh, which is you can think of them as spot instances in AWS, uh, custom machine type. This one is really interesting because AWS does not allow you to create custom machine types. So the fact that you can specify the CPU that you need and the memory that you need. This is really, really good. This is not something that is not available on AWS. And also, the fact that you can resize disk with no, with no downtime. Um, I haven't really looked into this much. I know you can do the same thing. You can expand your EBS volume on AWS without downtime. But the problem is you still have to, how do I say this? You still have to like uh, kind of format your disk, right? All right, and I also expand it to the to the new volume size, and also the startup script. Those are two things that AWS offers. So that's one thing I learned, I picked up today actually. And one other thing I did today was uh, I released. If you go to my uh, my blog, I released um, a blog about right. I mean tracking your your Kubernetes ingress with uptime robot and Slack, which is. Uh, isn't this this new project called this new controller this ingress controller well ingress monitor controller rather that tracks your ingresses and creates a corresponding endpoint in uptime robots and an uptime robot kind of notifies you when it's up when it's down this kind of information so those are like the two main things i picked up i kind of brought today and also picked up and the last thing i picked up today that i think it's going to be useful is a um, couple of like Linux command. Uh, one of them is uh, if top and uh, net args, right? Then we have what we call the uh, the uh, IP trap, all right? So those are the three main tools that I picked up today. I'm going to be releasing a blog post on them. Um, yeah, I have a blog post that I'm probably going to release very soon. You can see it in writing right here. Um, if tops, I'll tell you about if top, right? And you will see that in my blog post. So those are the thing, main things that I picked up. I think it's going to be useful for people who are in um, uh, DevOps infrastructure, like system admin space. Um, all right, I'll see you guys tomorrow.